What's going on, guys? I'm back with another episode of a TV and movie podcast. Today, I got for you Big Brother 25, episode 37. Last episode, we saw a crazy double eviction. Blue was evicted. I think America was evicted first, then Blue was evicted. This episode, we see kind of how that all goes down. And it wasn't a blind side for Blue either. You know, America knew she was going home. But Blue, Blue knew like seconds before the eviction because Felicia told her. And I'm not surprised that Felicia was the one that told Blue because Felicia has a history of spilling the beans, bro. Like, she, she, she bro, she just leaks so much information, man. Like, it is what it is. That's just her game, I guess. But, you know, it seemed like she was just telling Blue this time around because she kind of felt bad about it, which I bet Blue appreciated it. And so Blue goes up to Jag and asks, yo, Jag, is it true that what I'm hearing from Blue is that I was going to be voted out? And Jag's like, yeah. And, you know, I, I would expect Blue to be a little bit more upset, but she kind of understands because, you know, Jag kind of says, yo, you, you're going to take that shot at us. And Blue kind of acknowledges that you're right. Yeah, I was going to take that shot at you. She even said that for the final three personally, I, I hoped it would have been me, you, and Matt. But game-wise, it was y'all asses, meaning y'all y'all had to go. And they kind of hug it out and laugh about it. And then right before Blue goes home, Blue tells Sari that, you know, I kind of figured it out that you're Jared's mom. And poosh, I didn't even think we, I totally forgot all about that. You know, that was a whole thing. So, you know, that was like, you know, kind of cool to see that old Blue, Blue actually figured it out. And so uh, she told Sari, and the Sari said in the diary room that she kind of appreciated that Blue, you know, kept that secret. So, you know, that was pretty cool of her. And uh, yeah, and so then we see that Bowie, Bowie wins the uh, HOH, uh, and then tells Felicia she's going to be the pawn next to America. So yeah, I think America was actually voted out after Blue. So yeah, 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 yeah. that's right, that's right. And then... Uh, America is like, you know, she's upset because she knows she's going home, but she tries to tell Jag, yo, I won't go after you, but, you know, it's, it doesn't matter because they already decided that you're going to go home and that their final four is going to be Sari and Felicia. But, hey, you never know. That could change, especially in this episode, man, especially in this episode, because we see that Jag is like, you know, he hears from Felicia last episode that, yo, Sari was trying to get Matt, and Matt said he was on board to getting rid of Jag, and she tells Jag this, and then Jag's like, well, I don't believe this. Why would my boy Matt want to come after me, right? And so he, Jag wants to go talk to Matt about it, and Jag actually basically asks Matt, yo, Matt, did Sari ask you to target me? And Matt says, no. No, she didn't. And meanwhile, Matt's thinking, yo, I, I did. I did want to target Jag. And then I got to talk to Sari about this because how does Jag know about this? And so Matt talks to Sari about this. And then Sari is, is completely dumbfounded because she didn't even say this to Matt. It was actually Felicia that mentioned it to Sari about how Matt was the one that told Felicia that she wanted to get rid of Jag. So, like, Felicia just is just, you know, messing up people's game just because she has a bad memory. Like, Felicia's throwing Sari under the bus for something that she said to Matt. So, or that Matt said to her. And it's, it's crazy how that all happened. So, yeah. Yeah. So, now Jag really wants Sari out. Matt still wants to work with both Jag and Sari. Felicia wants Matt and Jag out. Same with Sari. That's how we are heading into this HOH. Bowie can't play. And so this HOH is just like bowling. And uh, you got to basically call out the person that you want to strike out because it's going to have their face as a pin. And if you knock somebody else's pin and you call out someone else's name, it, that the, the pin that you knock out doesn't, doesn't count. It gets back. It gets put back up. But I think that's kind of lame that they do that. Like, let's say if I want to get rid of, you know, um, Bowie or something, I accidentally hit Jag's name. 
and so Jag still is good. Like I, I think that's kind of dumb. Like but it's whatever, right? And yeah, so uh, Maddie Ice wins the HOH, bro. So this is good for Matt. Matt finally won his first HOH. He's thinking ah, I could take that shot at Jag, but man, I kind of I kind of want to chill on Jag because I know that Jag wants to bring me to the final two. So. I'm not going to go after Jag because I feel like I've done enough that I could beat Jag in the final two. And I'm thinking, Matt, this might be your downfall. Go after Jag now. This is the perfect opportunity. But Matt just thinks that after this HOH win, he's going to win the game. And so he wants to just target Felicia. Bro, final five, final four, and you want to target Felicia? Oh, come on, bro. I just think that's a mistake. I think he's making a Cody mistake, but we'll find out, man. We'll find out. So he wants to target Felicia. He tells Sari this. Sari's like, no, man, we got to get rid of Jag. And Jag is, meanwhile, Jag is telling Matt, yo, we got to get rid of Sari. And, and Felicia just, <laughs> Felicia just wants to, I think Felicia wants Jag out, but like Felicia's going to be on the block no matter what. And I think who's in the best spot right now? It's Bowie. Honestly, it's Bowie, man. Because even though Bowie, even though Bowie is like kind of like a floater, she's won a couple HOHs. And I don't think she's going to touch the block this week. So, hey, who knows? But anyway, we see that Matt decides to nominate Sari and Felicia on the block. And we're going to find out, or y'all already know. I, have, I haven't watched the episode yet, so I got to go and watch it real quick and see who ends up going home. Because I think it, it was an eviction episode for episode 38, right? Or, or was it just a veto? I got to watch the veto. Y'all watching the, the eviction tonight. Maybe I'll catch up with y'all. We'll find out, man. This has been a TV and movie podcast. If you're listening and watching, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bless up and peace.